Hey, it's Peter here, and in this video, I want to show you the six step process that I go through every time I want to create a video sales letter, just like the one you're watching right now on the screen, that will go on to generate thousands of dollars in sales. So the video you're watching on your screen right, screen right now is the video sales letter for my recent product launch uh, called Instant Video Templates Version 4. And this video alone um, has been responsible so far and just today alone in over $30,000 in sales. And that's, again, just today. Now, again, I'm going to show you some stats that this video is, res is responsible for helping create but when I show you these stats, please know that I'm not showing these stats to you to brag to you to, you know, to say, oh, look how cool I am, look how much money I'm making or anything like that. I'm basically going to show you these stats to prove a point, to prove that, you know, if you have a well-crafted video sales letter, I mean, you can really, you can really sell your product. So let's jump over to it. So this is inside my JVZoo account. So you can see today alone, um, sales for instant video templates version four, we've got uh, over 1,700 sales, uh, over $30,000 in revenue, um, and you know, just when we went live five minutes before midnight last night, we generated $500 in revenue. So total around $35,000 in gross revenue in just one day, actually less than one day. And again, I'm just showing this to you to prove my point and to hopefully maybe motivate you to show you what is possible once you get this stuff down. Now, there's a six-step process that I go through uh, whenever I want to create a sales video or a video sales letter, let me say it correctly, uh, that I go through every time I want to create one of these videos. And if you're interested in learning what that six step process is, then stick around uh, and watch this entire video because I'm going to show it all to you. So let's go ahead and get started. So what is the first thing that I do whenever I want to create a sales video for a product? Now, assuming the product's already done, right the products already done and I needed to create a video sales letter to put on the page like this to basically do the brunt work the brunt of the work for selling this product well first of all I would start off with a technique I call uh, the brain spill so the brain spill technique or the brain spill step is the first step in my six step process I'm gonna pull up an example of the brain spill so what I do is, before I start my video, I know that I need to have a script, right? So I pull up a notepad document, and I just start sketching ideas down. So I start sketching down uh, things that I want to cover in my video. Maybe I want to cover, um, I don't know, how easy the templates are to use, right? Um, what software they need. What pain do the template solve? Right? And I could go on and on and just list like maybe a half a dozen or a dozen um, things or topics that I want to cover in my sales video. So at this point, we don't have a script yet, right? We just have like six to 12 key points that we want to cover in, in our video. And those key points should speak to the viewer's needs and their pain points. Uh, so if you're uh, if your viewer has a pain, then you should definitely aim to uh, address that pain in the video and then offer them a solution. In my case, the pain for people who buy my instant video templates product would be um, video creation is too hard, right? Video creation is too hard. Templates make it easy. Or, or uh, video creator software. I know that some people have technical issues using video creator software. So I might use that to my advantage. I might say um, video creators are difficult. I'm not, and again, I'm going to spell this wrong. I'm just typing it fast. Difficult to use. Templates are easy to use. Right? And I would just go on listing ideas. And then once I've got my the brain spill technique done, I've got you know a good solid 6 to 12 key points that I want to cover, then I will start roughing out my script. And this is what I rough script looks like and I kind of covered this in a tutorial video the other day where I kind of outlined my script writing technique and basically what what this involves is taking my key points here and then transforming them into a rough script so at this point I'll just open up another notepad document and I will just start telling my story about my product um, I would just introduce myself 
um, tell the viewer what they're going to learn in the video, and then obviously uh, talk about a big benefit to them for watching the video. I'm going to tell them about how I'm going to solve one of their pains right off the bat. And then once I do that, then I get into the actual story around my product. I tell them, you know, uh, how I got started uh, in video marketing, um, and then how uh, I started when I started using animated videos. I started making more profits, things like that. And then I just go into, you know, explaining how the templates make video creation easy. So that's the basic story around my product, right? So what you can do is you can open up a Notepad document and just start telling the story about your product. It's really not that hard. Just type like type your story into a notepad document as if you were talking to someone right next to you. Don't type it, you know, with perfect grammar and perfect spelling or anything like that. Type your video script uh, like you would actually speak it to someone in a coffee shop or at a bar. That's what you want to do. And explain it in a way, you know, explain the stuff you're trying to explain to your viewer any way um, that you would explain it to a five-year-old, okay? I know that sounds kind of kind of silly, but that's what you need to do. You need to make things easy to understand for people. So that's step two. So step one is to brain spill, open up a notepad document, and just start spilling your thoughts until you get a good six to 12 key bullet points you want to cover in your video, and then start taking those bullet points and transforming them into a rough script. Now the rough script is literally how it sounds. Um, you just start typing. You do not worry about spelling. You do not worry about punctuation, English, grammar, anything like that. You just start spilling your thoughts and forming it into a script. The reason why I don't worry about spelling errors and things like that when I'm creating the rough script is because when you find yourself making a typo or something and you go back to correct it, you're your thought process is interrupted. You interrupt the flow of creativity. So you do not want to up interrupt that flow of creativity. You just want to transform what's in your brain into your fingertips, onto the keyboard, and into this notepad document. So just basically, as long as you can understand it when you're done writing, um, you know, just basically spill those words. Don't worry about spelling. That's the rough script. And then once you've got the rough script done, and this is the exact rough script that I made for Instant Video Templates version 4, okay? And there's a, there's a bunch of spelling errors in here. But once you're done with that, then you can take that rough script and you turn it into um, a, a uh, fine-tuned script, basically. So basically, I will take that notepad document, I will paste it into a Word document, and I'm just going to take this highlight off here. So I'll paste it into a, note, a Word, what is this, a Microsoft Word document, and I will correct all the spelling errors and make it look all pretty, okay, and turn it into a script that anyone can read. And then you see these little red brackets here? Well, this is step number, uh, actually, this is step number three. This is where I actually break my script up into um, what I call an outline, or some people call it a storyboard. So I will take my script in Microsoft Word, and I will basically brainstorm the visuals of my video. So here's the first sentence of my video, right? It says, okay, so over the past few years, I've personally sold well over a million dollars worth of products and services online. So right here I have pan to JVZoo total, pan to Warrior Plus total, um, pan to Primo Press um, website contract total. So this is telling me that when I'm saying this sentence in my video, I, on the screen, I want to be displaying my JVZoo stats to show how much money I've made from video marketing, show my Warrior Plus stats, show when I sold PrimoPress.com for 80 grand, all those types of things. Then I move on to the next sentence. And one of the main things that helped me make all those sales was, was of course, video. So right here, I just um, typed out um, the sentence. So that basically tells me that I want to create a slide that basically just says the word video in all caps. So again, I just go through the script, the entire script, and I visualize what I want to be on the screen, right? And sometimes I'll get to a point in my script where I want to use a stock video clip. Um, you know, right here I say, or maybe I paid someone a bunch of money to make this video and all the other literally hundreds of sales videos I've created in the past for me and my clients. So right here, I tell myself I want to use a stock video clip of a cameraman rising up. And I also want to use a stock video clip of a video wall. And what I'll do is I will go on stock video sites like VideoBlocks or VideoHive.net 
and I'll find stock video clips that fit what I'm looking for in my video and I'll just paste the links in my outline so I know that when I get to that point in the video I can just click this link go buy the stock video clip and I'm good to go so this is the outline step number three and I basically do this for, for the entire script you can see here I just basically take a couple hours and I just totally just visualize and map out the entire visual part of my video right so I know that now I can take my script I know exactly the work I need to do inside PowerPoint I know the exact slides I need to create I know the exact stock video clips I need to make now I just need to start bringing it together so step number four is slide creation so this is where I actually get into PowerPoint okay now this is where the instant video templates products really shine um, because what I do is I take my script and my and you know once I have it all outlined I take I open a blank not usually not a blank but I open up one of my PowerPoint templates and then I start converting my script into visuals or I start creating the visual parts that I can inside PowerPoint so for example the first sentence in my video right here right I told myself that I wanted to show uh, a screencast video of my JVZoo stats and things like that so the first slide in my video I just put this note to myself here because that tells me that later on I need to go to Camtasia and I need to record my JVZoo stats on the screen all right um, now the next sentence is an actual slide right it says what helped me make all those sales video so what I did is why while, while I'm saying and what helped me make all those sales I show a question mark on the screen and then when I say video I show the video slide on the screen and then I move on simple animated marketing videos to be exact just like the one you're watching right now so I tell myself that I want a slide that says just like this video so I make a slide that says that just like this one okay the next part now you might think I use some fancy pants expensive video editing software to make this video and then I tell myself that I want to show a fake um, video maker e-cover here with a cartoon popping up onto the screen and that's what I did here okay so I just do that for the entire for the entire um, script and again when I get to a part of the script where I want to use a stock video obviously I'm not creating PowerPoint slides for that I just use a placeholder so later I can pop in that video clip so basically, you know, once the PowerPoint is done, you know, I've made all the slides, and these these are the exact slides I made for the Instant Video Templates version four sales letter. Uh, once I get all the slides done, right, I'll add animations to them. I'll add animations to the slides, and uh, then I'll go to File, Export, and then I will go to Create a Video, and I'll export this PowerPoint presentation directly to a video. Uh, and then once I have it to a video then I can go ahead and import it straight into Sony Vegas and that's exactly what I'm showing here on the screen this is my the Sony Vegas document that um, that I ended up creating to create the video sales letter for instant video templates version 4 and you can see how I basically have uh, all the the clips from the PowerPoint presentation split up and lined up with um, my script okay you can see my voice right here this is my actual voice uh, me reading the script this little audio track down here and then when I got all the PowerPoint slides inserted I will be left with blank points where I need to insert the stock video clips right so at that point let's say this part of the video right here let me just go there this is where I said in my outline that I wanted the camera uh, stock video clip of a cameraman rising up so again when I got to that point in the video I went and bought that stock video clip let me zoom in here because this is driving me nuts there we go so we get to this point of the video and I basically just insert that stock video clip of the cameraman rising up and then the next part is a video wall I want to show a video wall so again I go buy that stock video clip for the video wall and I insert that there right and I just manually build out the video like that and let's see what's what step is that that is step number one two three four step five is editing this is the editing process and then once the video is all done you know once I've got all my PowerPoint slides all inserted all synced together all my stock video clips inserted where they need to be all my screencast videos inserted where they need to be um, then I have my video at that point we can actually export it to uh, a video 
and we'll just go to, uh, I'm not going to show you how to do that here, but basically in Sony Vegas, you can just render a file straight to a video and you're, and you end up with an MP4 video that you can upload to, uh, your, your video hosting company and put it on your sales page and get it online for the world to see. And that is the final product that you see here on my sales page on instant video templates, uh, or, or on videorevolver.com forward slash IVT four. So that's how I created this sales video and literally all the other sales videos that have come before it. Um, now, like I said, the instant video templates product line, even though I'm using this video as an example to show you how I made the sales video, I also wanted to, to prove to you and show you how much easier your life can be with these templates because all these slides here, um, I had to manually create these at one point. You know, bef These were all created at a time before I had PowerPoint templates that I could easily reference. With my instant video templates, templates, you know, when you get to the PowerPoint step, which is the slide creation step, step number four, all you have to do, is, you know, you have your script all written, you have your outline already created, all your storyboard already created, you know what your video is going to look like. Then when you get to the PowerPoint step, all you have to do is open up one of my templates and edit it to create the slides that you need or combine my templates, several of my templates into one, whatever. So a few people were asking for some real world examples of how the instant video templates um, templates could be used by making a video. And this is exactly how they help. They help you make your visuals for your video quicker. They make that process so much easier. So I hope you um, got a lot out of this video, giving you some, you know, I've given you some insight into how I make my video sales letters and, and take it for what it's worth. I hope to help you out whether you pick up instant video templates version four or not. I hope you like the video um, and I will talk to you very, very soon.